Yeah, so it might be good. Not concrete blocks. I want. I'm, I'm getting concrete slabs, right? Yes. <laughs> yeah, I think so. Oh yeah, it's on it's on my screen. What am I doing? <laughs> I can see my own answer. Also, I know I've said this before, but just in case, uh, it's been a while. If, you, if Whenever you need to get out of here, you just... Oh, I'm know. good. Candace is at work. Okay. Okay, do I want to do extra? Yeah. <laughs> I thought you were like, do I want to help him out more? Nah, fuck this guy. <laughs> I don't think you're going to use those rolls for anything else, so I'm just going to grab as many as I can. Good enough for me. You just have colobs hanging around to, so they can ferry you across the water? Are colobs good for getting across water or something? They're, yeah, they're, they're big and they have huge mud tires on them. Mm. 71 inch mud tires but my thing with the co-ops is they're real low to the ground one of them especially the one with the big ass nose on it just seems to like sit down on top of the mud and still get stuck I do believe you can raise it up but I haven't done mine right oh okay I was about to say are you going to have a truck like that and not have a raised suspension yeah that seems like that sucks So I was talking with chat the other day, and I was like, I don't understand why an active suspension is better than a raised suspension. Well, so say you, um, some trucks are particularly tippy when okay. they uh, have raised. So having active, you can lower it down so you're not uh, tipping over randomly. Uh, and then you can raise it back up, crawling over rocks with your deep mud and stuff. That's what I would say. But yeah, generally, uh, I just go for raised. That is fun to uh, flex on your friends by the sit still. You can sit there and bounce up and down. But yeah, I don't, I don't know. Pretty much every truck that I have that's tippy when it's raised does not have the option for uh, active suspension. I have a giant behemoth of a truck that has active suspension, but it's it, it, it's never going to flip over unless you drive it off a cliff. And at that My point, problem. an active suspension is probably not going to help you anyway. Yeah. You're like, quick, lower the suspension. <laughs> You're like in midair. How did I do this so badly? Is there a hotkey for adjusting it, or does it have to be done in the context menu thing? Um, I think it has to be done through the functions menu. There may be a keyboard hotkey, but I, I'm not aware of it. Like. I know you can, like, some things have hotkeys, like starting your engine, that's a, you can hotkey that, which uh, I believe is already defaulted to, what is it, B? Uh, B is in Bravo? Uh, yeah, B. Oh, 
Come on. Man, I almost I almost pulled a trick here. I almost rolled over the uh, twin steer. <laughs> Alright, where the hell am I taking this? Over there. Okay. Hey, I can cross that bridge for the very first time. Never had Ooh. to cross this bridge before. Oh. Watch where you're going. Sorry. Sorry, you better apologize. Ship, but on ice chains. Oh, hey, what's up, buddy? Hey. I got a better horn this time. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> Go ahead. I might not make it up here. Yeah, I'm not going to make it up this. You can come fast. Bro, are you pulling two trailers Tra behind you? Yeah, yeah. Said I was getting all the rolls. <laughs> well, I didn't think you meant like that. I thought you meant like... <laughs> I'm going to go get ice chains. I just thought you meant like I was. I, I went and got a big trailer and I'm gonna go fill it up even though I don't need six or whatever. <laughs> I'm going. Pretty sure you're gonna need them down there, anyways. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna put them into it. I'm gonna set them next to it so you can uh, load them in if you need them or pick them up if you don't. Well, thank you. Like, I'm not. I'm not sure if you put them in if you can get them back out or not. Um, indirectly, you can. Okay. You turn them into metal beams. Oh. And then you put the metal beams in there and they'll spit out two rolls of metal. Oh, okay. So you, you, you can just recycle metal beams. That's really all you have to do. But yeah, set, setting them beside is totally fine with me. Okay, so now we just need cabins. Oh. 
I also want to thank everybody in chat for reminding me to put uh, chains on my tires. <laughs> Did they? Nope. <laughs> I called it. Bad chat. Okay, there we go. It puts them on the back tires too, right? Don't tell me you put it on the front tires and not the rear drive tires. Surely not. Okay, no, there's chains on the back too. Good deal. Okay. It's like I swear I, mean, I swear to god if this game, the game puts it on your front tires only, I'm gonna be so pissed. Does it look like I'm driving an Apache? Give me chains. Ah One cabin also needs two wooden planks, so I need to take four wooden planks to yeah. the cabin construction site. I'll do that one then. Um, you know what's funny is when you're driving around, you see wooden planks literally everywhere, and now I'm sitting here going, where the hell are wooden planks? Yeah. <laughs> oh, how did you end up in the woods? Stop. Okay, wood frame, wood frame, wood frame. Okay, there we go. Well, I can turn off, um, let's take off my chains then. Cause I'm gonna be going in mostly mud areas now. Okay. There's wood framing there. Is there a second one close by? Kinda. Oof. This thing can't go in the mud though. What the hell am I trying to do here? Okay, I can get that. Okay, let's do that. There's wood framing there. There we go. Okay. You have to play musical trailers when you do that, right? Yeah, yeah, you can't uh, do anything with the one that has a winch on it.
man, it makes it so much easier swapping between like mud and ice sections on roads when I have the hotkeys now. Oh yeah. Oh, so much better. Cause like I I set it to numlock, and so literally I'm just like one, four, and seven are my my lows, and like five is my auto, two is reverse. So I can go from like reverse to low plus in like a quarter of a second, where before it took me like three seconds to move the gear shifter over there. Right. That's pretty good. I wish. Uh... Oh, no, I can't control her. I've already got so many things bound on her already. Mm -hmm. What do you use the D-pad for on the controller? Uh, that opens your, uh, up opens your function menu, uh, left and right do nothing, down opens your, um, status or profile menu, I guess. Hmm. I guess you could set left, if, if it allows you to, you could set left to low plus and right to auto or something. Yeah. Like two of the more common gears that you're going to switch to. Right, yeah. And at the very least, it will uh, get you closer to reverse or something. Yeah. I don't even know if the... If it'll let you do that on controller, though. I'll have to look. Probably not, though. Oh, shit. Hold on. What the fuck? I thought there was a road all the way down there. Didn't I not just go down there? No, I'm taking the railroad tracks on. So there's going to be railroad tracks all the way to the factory. I wish the map made the railroad tracks more obviously not a road. Yeah. Because I see Big Brown Streak, I think, road. Yeah, dirt not. road. Yeah. Okay, okay, go all over. Oh, good, there's a crash train, too. Swell. Guarantee I'm going to roll this truck over down here. Good luck, sir. Either this truck or that trailer behind me is going over. Yay, I got up that hill. Good job. Now that I have those hotkeys, I can... It's really helpful. I can just slam between those gears real quick. Oh, yeah. Honest. Why don't you guys do that in real life? Just instantly go from reverse to low plus. That's amazing. <laughs> Your truck loves that, doesn't it? That's how I stop these days, is just slam it into reverse. <laughs> I mean, it stops the truck, right? It does stop the truck. Who wants to make a bet I'm coming back here to pick all these things up <laughs> with the empty trailer? I'll put one internet dollar on that. One internet dollar. I'm honestly surprised that ramp trailer hasn't dumped yet. I'm wondering if it gets a little more forgiving because it's not attached to a truck. Maybe. It, it's able to wobble around a little more freely on its own, perhaps. 
Because normally once it reaches a certain degree, it just releases the cargo and dumps it off. Yeah. There we go. There's got to be a road. That is kind of a road. So I'll take that instead. Is this game worth a buy? If you're into this kind of stuff, absolutely. Like, if you're like, my favorite game style is, uh, you know, Elden Ring, well, maybe not. <laughs> you know. Yeah. But no, if it you... Be... Sorry, go ahead. I was just gonna say, if you like uh, American Truck Sim or stuff like that, yeah, man. Yeah, if you like simulators, it is it is dumb good. Especially helpful if you've never outgrown playing with toy trucks. Oh yeah. Why is my chat? I have the not even the most expensive like I don't even have all the stuff with it. And I'm missing the latest two story DLCs. And I have 142 hours into the game and I've only finished Let's see. I've only finished Michigan and Alaska. I have Tamir Cola, Yukon. Wisconsin, Amur, and then there's Dawn and Maine left and to, to even purchase. And that's just like 142 hours and I've only finished two out of like eight maps. Yeah. It's insane how much playtime you get out of this thing. How are the missions? Uh, repetitive, but I mean... I mean, it's, the whole game is... Welcome to a simulator. Yeah, fetch missions. <laughs> yeah. Go get this, take it there. Yeah, exactly. Repetitive. But I mean, if you're into simulators, that's not a surprise. Right. I'm going to see if I can go down the train tracks with the twin steer. Go for it. Skirt! Uh, I may have made a mistake. <laughs> that was quick. Pull my rear end off of this thing. Come on. Yeah, well, as soon as I got the uh, the railroad tracks in between um, both sets of tires, and I don't have front wheel drive. Oh yeah. Are you stuck? A little bit. Do you require assistance? Give me a second here. Sure. I'm gonna see if I can get out on my own. I believe in you. That makes one of us. I always believe in you. Aw, spoon. <laughs> Nope, I was going the right way. There we go. Uh, I appear to be climbing a tree with my truck. <laughs> In reverse. <laughs> All right, all right, I'm free. All right, cool. You're like, good, I didn't want to have to come over there and get you. Nah. Oh no, there's tons of stuff in this game, like. Hold on. 
I have a cargo list up. There are metal beams, wood planks, concrete slabs, concrete blocks, bricks, cement, metal rolls, small pipes, medium pipe, large pipe, service spare parts, drilling spare parts, vehicle spare parts, consumables, oil, fuel, uh, secure cargo container, cargo container, oversized container, cabins, drilling equipment, oil rig drill, uh, and then there's crafting in the game now. So, yeah, there's lots of different types of deliveries. Like right now, for example, this job we're on requires, uh, if you look in the top right hand corner, it says uh, factory sewage treatment facilities requires uh, two cabins to be delivered to the residential area. Uh, if you noticed, cabin is a special item. You can't, you can't like go and pick up a cabin. There's a construction site over here and a cabin requires one cargo container and two wooden planks. So you have to go get one cargo container, two wooden planks, take them to the cabin construction area, make a cabin, load the cabin up, take it where it needs to go. So, like, there's a lot to this. It's not, it's not quite so mindless as just like, pick up a tree, take a tree, pick up another tree, take a tree. Yeah. And then in certain situations, like what we just had, uh, there wasn't enough material on this map to make the products that we needed to make. So we had to go to a different map attached to this one to get some of the products, bring it back here, then construct the item we need. Ooh. Ooh. Oh yeah. I'm so glad that Ford's still over here. What, the F-750? Yeah. You needed some gas or something? No, I just need to hook it to this trailer and move it so I can unload it. Gotcha. Oh, I don't have to leave cargo lane in the middle of the area. Oh my god. Just tell me that there's nothing nearby you can winch to, okay? Stop winching to saplings. <laughs> Please. Ah, oh, don't do that. Okay. I'm roll the truck, Jesus. Alright, now let's pick you. You tell me you can't reach that tree. Oh, you are right outside the range. Cheap. Okay. Hey, we're moving. But yeah, you can usually get this game on sale in a bundle that contains everything except the most two, the two most recent DLC for like if, twenty something bucks. If I remember correctly, it's in. Maybe I'm thinking of a different game, but I think it might be in uh, the Ukraine bundle. And Humble bundle. The Ukraine Humble bundle. Yeah, I might double check that, but I. I think I saw it, or maybe I'm thinking of Satisfactory. Yeah. That's on Steam. That is on Steam, yep. Uh, it's on Steam and in Epic, I think. Yeah. Um, and yeah, you might try, you might check that Ukraine Humble Bundle. Because give money to Ukraine, but also, like, you would, I think it's 40 bucks, but you end up getting, like, 40 something games with it. Yeah. I looked at it, but I own almost every single game on the Ukraine Humble Bundle. Yeah. And I was all like, uh. I did get the, uh, the other one that has like 900 and something indie, indie titles on it. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Yes. 
There's only like a handful of games on there I, I actually think I'll play, but... Okay. Where do these need to go? Carter containers go to where? There we go, jeez. I'm free! Okay, yeah, I've got the two containers. Okay. I've got... Uh, go ahead. Uh, uh, if you ever need to move those rolled steel, I'm just going to bring a small thing. Okay. I got two out of the four pieces of wood, and I'm going to go... I'm halfway to getting the other two right now. Okay. Um, there are two wood planks right next to that residential area. That's where I'm going. Oh, okay. Oh, shit. What? I'm not going to be able to get up this hill. No chains? Or all yeah. drive, not black of all drive? Uh, both. <laughs> okay. Uh, where are you? Wait, 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 wait. Oh, almost. Fuck. Okay, well, I'm, I'm headed. That's not really out of the way. I can go through the if you need it. Uh, yeah, man. I just want to get pulled. Oh, shite. Okay, here, let's do this number. Oh, my God. There we go. That's a big tree. All right, cool. Okay, got over that. Roll back downhill for a second. Wait, what the hell was that? The engine is stalling. What the hell? Uh, too high over here. Oh, I was in high. How did I get in high? <laughs> I never use high. All right. Are you at the top of the hill or are you at the bottom of the hill? I am climbing the hill on the other side. Oh, I see. I'm, I'm on a hill. Now I'm going downhill. If you can get to the top of this hill, yeah. Uh, I can get really close to the top, and then I there's just nothing for me to latch onto. Gotcha. So if you can get to the top and then just sit there and be a heavy object, I can do that. Uh, stick your stick your butt out though, so that I can grab the uh, the rear end and you can start gunning it forward or something. Oh wait, where am I? I can get like eighty five percent of the way up the uphill part. And right at about that point, that's when my truck starts to stop. That's the worst. It's like, I'm right fucking there. Yeah, I'm Come. real close. Good thinking, too, Talon. Don't forget those cha Oh, thanks, man. <laughs> Stick your butt out so I can grab it. Dude, that's not the first time I've said that to Lucid, either. It's true. I didn't check the map, but I think you're down this way. Right there, right there. Okay. You turn around. And as soon as I winch onto you, you just gun it. I'll let you know. Alright. Whoa. Not that far down. Go further up. Like, right about there. I should be able to reach you there. Okay. Alright, let's, let's, let's try it. Go, 
go. Yes. 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 All right, I'm good. All right. Woo. Thanks, truck daddy. Yeah. I was like, and go <laughs> right when I hit it, right when I hit winch, <laughs> and it all, it felt like my truck did not stop moving. Yeah, that was some good uh, some good timing on oh, both yeah. on both ends there. Teamwork makes the dream work. I also had it in low plus and holding the brake because I didn't want to sit there with the handbrake on and try to turn everything off to get moving. Mm-hmm. Grabbing, grabbing Lucid's butt is super nice. Yeah, dude. Oh, yeah. There's a lot of meat back there. Mm -hmm. I do squats. It's a good time for everybody. There he is. There's no Hank Hill butt over here. No, sir. All right, cool. Thanks. <laughs> it's just ice right in the middle of the intersection. So I'm like, ah, yeah. and turn. And my truck's like, nah. Nah, I'm going to keep That's, going straight. That thing's got a bad enough turning radius as it is. I know. Now with more understeer. <laughs> oh, God, brakes, 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 brakes. Brakes, 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 brakes. Everybody. <laughs> I'm cool now, right? I'm I'm cool, cool with the kids. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I am hip with the lingo. Yep. Big facts, no cap. <laughs> I don't know what any of that is. Is that like getting crunk? No. <laughs> That's still a thing, right? No. Oh. I think, I think it stopped being a thing almost immediately. <laughs> I remember Cappy and I were sitting at a restaurant, and these high school kids came in and sat like two or three tables over, and they started like hollering at each other about how they were going to get crunk and stuff. And Cappy and I looked at each other like, what the hell are they talking about? Where are you going? Oh, you're going to get the other wood. Yeah, wood. I'm going to get the other wood. I'm like, what the fuck is crunk? And we had to go <laughs> Google crunk. And I was like, wow, dude, is this is, is this what my mom felt like when I came home? And I was like, oh, man, <laughs> that movie was tight. <laughs> my mom was probably like, is he on drugs? <laughs> Where did I go wrong? Where did I go wrong? <laughs> I was just like, oh my god, I have no idea what's going on. The fuck is crunk? I mean, you know what's funny is the, the whole Grandpa uh, Simpson thing. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The one I, where he, I, like, I, comes in, turns around, puts his hat on, leaves again? No, no, the way he's like, uh, you know, I used to be with it, now what's it? <laughs> it's weird and scary. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I'm just like saying, Grandpa. Fucking saying. Yeah, I'm like. And we felt. It was funny because we did that and we were both like 23, 22 or 23, and we're like, how are we so far out of touch already? <laughs> I'm like, we've been out of high school like f four or five years, however, depending on how old we were at the time. Yeah. And we're like, neither of us had any earthly idea what the hell that w they were saying. I feel like the advent of the internet has sped up how quickly generations differ. Yeah, probably. Because I remember in school was we were still saying things, I mean, different than what my parents said, but you could definitely see there was some overlap. There's zero overlap. It could be two years apart. Completely different. Uh, I think I'm going to recover this truck and refuel because I'm out of fuel. Actually, I need to figure out what's up next. 
You gotta take the two containers. I know. Where's this oil tank? Do you want to do that? What's that? Uh, the oil tank so much earlier. Oh, is that a big honking thing? Uh, it looks like it. I don't know what saddle size is required, though. It'll probably say once you, uh, deliver that. Oh, is that like the next mission that, that unlocks after this one? The next stage, no. Oh, I got you, I got you, I got you. God damn it. Help. 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 Okay. Oop, that's the wrong. Well, I need to do that anyways, as I feel. Uh, where did you go? Womp. Womp. Is it ice? No. No. It's thick mud, no trees. Oh. Eh, we're going to be here. I'm still trying on my own, but... Yeah, I was going to say, uh, stay there, because I don't have a bed on this one. I'm just going to crane them down to you. All right, four wood loaded. Oh, you got it? <sighs> yeah, so far. Let's see if I can get out of here. Yeah, I was I was able to finagle my way out of there. Nice. Finagle. I bet you kids say that all the time nowadays. <laughs> I think that's one of those words that's only survived its definition by context. Yeah, I'm gonna need to get across that, so you just chill right there. All right. I think I think I may need you. Huh. with my lights. Uh, You're almost there. I'm trying to do it without Lucid. <laughs> nope. Fuck that tree. Here we go. That's a solid tree. Great job. I'm not in the All clear right. yet. No. Almost. Almost. Come on. <laughs> okay. Alright, I'm good, I think. Oh, boy. <laughs> The final, the final chair. Ah! Oh shit! 
<laughs> Why am I leaning that far? What the hell? Okay. <laughs> I have no idea. My truck was You're... beyond 45 degrees. I have no You're... idea how it didn't roll. Your back tires were up on a rock, which is oh. causing the whole thing to tilt over. Were they? Yeah. I was say, if you drive forward, it'll come off, but you move in time. Ooh. That's the hard part about the back tires on this thing is the truck is so long that yeah. the, the camera cuts off the rear tires. I don't even get to see them half the time. Yeah. And because it's twin steer and the... Um, well, not because it's twin steer, but because the bed is a permanent attached thing on this truck, uh, I can't hit... I can't switch the camera and, like, zoom in at the back of the truck. Yeah. Because it doesn't... It. it doesn't recognize that as a separate piece. Yeah. Uh, let's... Nope, nope. There we go. Okay. One. Wooden planks. Construct. One. Two cabins. Load them up. All right, where am I going? Hey, do you have gas? I do, yeah. Oh, I'm going to the residential area? Oh, shoot. Just the place we were just at that I was struggling with. Uh. Give me some of your gas. Womp, womp. Thanks. Well, some of that just disappeared. Uh, how much do you have? Uh, half, half a tank. Okay, I have three quarters of a tank. 20 gallons disappeared. <laughs> don't know where they went. That's fine. Oh. oh. Okay. Sorry. No, we're good. <laughs> oh, shit. Jesus, dude. These missions are no joke. Yeah, man. If you're looking at the... Look at the ones that are like... Oh, God. There's so many, dude. Yeah. This map has got a lot of long missions. Yeah. There's like... I think there's three for conveyor belts in the other map. And then there's two more factory missions in this map that are also just as long as the one we just did. Plus all the tasks we have to do. I was just like, oh my god. <laughs> it's a lot of work here. That being said, I'm gonna dump these cabins on the floor right here. On the floor? Yeah, man. Just in the in the mud. I'm gonna drop them right here. Oh, yeah. No! Okay. Yeah, there's a lot of logging that has to be done. Yeah. Do you need me to crane them off or are you good? If I can get up this hill, I should be alright. I thought I was going to roll the truck over, and I just managed not to, so I'm okay at the moment. <laughs> We're going to tell this construction site, fuck your fence. Aw, oh, man. Don't do this to me. Uh, yeah. I'm gonna need some assistance here. On the way. Help is on the way, dear. I said that in my head. <laughs> up, 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 up. Hey, never mind. Wait, yeah. do, do they have to be craned off? They might have to be. Oh. I know one mission I did cabins, I had to set them off into the area. But, yeah, okay, so okay, you, if you can bring a happy little crane over this way, I'd be appreciative. Oh man, Truck Daddy got here fast. Truck Daddy's got a fast truck. If I'd have put mud tires on there, I'd already be there.
Well, you got chains on them or something? Yeah, I haven't took the chains off. There he is. Stupid snow. Do you need me to stick my butt out? No, I'm good. <laughs> If you want to, do it. Okay. okay. What cool. a fucking weird setup they have here. It's yeah, like, I... put them under this awning. Yeah, dude, it's really inconvenient. Okay, I've, I've unpacked. Okay. So you should be able to pull one off. Yeah. And if you need me to, to move my truck later, just let me know. I'll probably have you back up. Oh, All right. shit. You gotta move your arm a little. There you That's go. Stuck under the awning. The roof? Yeah, the roof is stupid. Yeah. <laughs> I love watching you work your crane, because I'm very, like, meticulous and slow with my crane stuff. Yeah. And I just watch Lucid, like, pick this thing up, and he's just like, whip this bitch over here. <laughs> <laughs> How are you going to get it up under there? Jesus. I don't know. Um, I wonder if I can just... Drop it and then like push it in like a. Well, no, I'm gonna try to. Oh, oh, oh! Hold up, a little higher. Yep, you've almost got the feet in there. There you go. There you go. Yeah, it goes through the roof, so I can just. Oh, okay, okay. Now just two. Down. Hey, look at that. Yeah, push it in there like a forklift. Scoot that little full over. I had to make sure it's inside the lines because it won't count if it doesn't. The whole thing has to be in the line. That sucks. Yeah. They should make it like as long as like 80% is in there. You would think. Is that in a good position? Yeah, you're good. All the furniture falls to one side. <laughs> That's what's happening, dude. <laughs> All the chairs are just rolling around in there. This is going to do one of those weird things where all of a sudden it just disappears on you and goes like clunk. No, I think it stays there. Oh, really? Yeah. Get, get on in there. Get on, get. <laughs> You gotta push it a little to the left. Yeah. To the layup. To the layup. I think it's stuck on something. Come on. Yeah, You're doing me. it. Hey! Our cutscene has occurred. <laughs> oh, look at that. It built up one of our factories. Oh, nice. Alright, deliver oil tanker. Recover. Saddle high required. Uh, saddle high, huh? Okay. I'll get that. Okay. I will plan the next trip. Oh, I guess we're going to keep working on factory, huh? Yeah, slowly get that factory maxed out or something. Uh, is that a more powerful? No, I have the most powerful engine. Off-road is best. Where am I? Here's a question. Where am I taking this thing? All right, I am taking this trailer to unloading zone three. Okay. Oh, I've got to get up that hill. Ugh, fuck. <laughs> uh. I think I need chains on my tires. 
I hate having to say that, but... Alright, so we're gonna roll chains on this one. Alright, so... Gotta take the trailer out there and get those metal frames. You mean if I can't do mud tires, chains are the way to go? Of course. I can do mud tires anywhere I want. I should have mud tires for everything. Yeah. That's the bad thing, though. It's like mud tires are super great for everything except the one hill in this game that's got lots of ice on it and you just can't get up it. Oh, I could go around it. Mud tires it is for me. Oh, not on this truck. It, well, no, that's fair. But I mean, this truck doesn't need mud tires. This truck will literally destroy everything in its way. What's that? The the dairy. Oh yeah, dairy's pretty good. I got the 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 old dairy. I, I have the new dairy too, but the old dairy is a little more powerful. So I have neither of the dairies. I've yet to unlock them. Really? I, I have every single truck in the game except for the two dairies and one Russian truck. Dude, this I like the spare tires on the dairy. Have you seen the spare tires on the old dairy? Um, it, it looks like you carry an entire axle with two tires on it behind the cab of the truck. Oh, that's dope. Are, are you here at the garage? Yeah. Here, come over here. Okay, so here you go, the trailer. Nope. Idiot. Damn it. Uh, oh shit, that's cool. Yeah. And it's got like a giant winch thing in the middle there. Pretty dope oh, looking. Yeah. That is very cool. Alright, anyway, I'm gonna go deliver that oil tanker real quick. coming along with you. Oh, cool. There's uh, some buildings out there. I'm going to go steal their materials instead of using up raw material. Yeah, buddy. You getting some metal? Uh, metal and bricks. Nice. The one thing is the dairy has a worse turning uh, worse turning than the twin steer. Really? Yeah, it turns like a like a hippo, dude. It's. <laughs> oh, I might need you for this part. Maybe. You might yeah, need might to. To winch onto me or something? Yeah, yeah. Uh, no, looks like I got it. Maybe it's not as bad as the twin steer, but it's definitely sluggish when compared to all the other trucks. Yeah. Because this one actually, this one is front wheel drive, I think. I mean, it's, it's all wheel drive, but it's... I think it's front by default. Oh no, it's permanent all-wheel drive. Never mind. <laughs> there was one truck I found that was front-wheel drive by default somewhere, and I don't remember I, which one it was. I know the Apache's front-wheel drive by default. Just wild and stupid. Makes her thirsty? This is not the thirstiest truck I have. Like, the dairy's kind of thirsty, but... I have a truck that, ch like... Even in uh, even in automatic, it chugs like five gallons a minute, and I'm just like, oh my god, this thing will just stop drinking. And it's only got like a 70 gallon tank too, and I'm like, oh. You drive that thing for 10 or 15 minutes before it's empty. <laughs> Watch out! There's a big rock in the middle of the road there. Not for me. I mean, it 
Uh, I'm sliding. You're stuck? No, I'm sliding. Oh, oh, me too. Even with chains, I slid through there. Yeah. Oh, whoa. Wait, I slid pretty I crazy down that hill. Am I supposed to climb up through here? This is my... All right. This is where we part ways, I guess. Uh, I'll see you again. There's a big ass tree in the way. I'm not supposed to get past that. Knock it over? No, it's like falling across the road. Drive over it. It's very high up. Hit it until it disappears into the ground. Oh, it is one that disappears. Okay. I was all like, I'm going to come up with a bunch of different ideas here. Yeah, this is one of the trucks that has uh, always-on, all-wheel drive, and uh, differential. So he, he pretty beefy. What are you, what, are you getting stuck on something? Yeah, it's just that big-ass tree went and disappeared. Did you get it? Yeah, I got it. Okay. A little take may have been better for this. Ow. Oh, whoa! What is this trailer? Wow, dude. Cool trailer. This, this thing is wild. Did you see it? Yeah. It's got this giant metal, or I'm sorry, wooden rigging in the middle. Because I guess the thing is hollow like a donut. Oh, yeah. Recover, no. Attach, yes. There we go. What the frick? Man, I want this to be daytime so I can see this a little better.